Yeah, well, uh, LC uh, tandem mass spectrometry is uh, still the most useful tool, tool when it's about uh, sensitive uh, um, determination of, uh, of analytes. Uh, we can benefit from uh, the so-called selected uh, reaction monitoring mode by uh, monitoring the uh, transition of a precursor ion to a product uh, ion for each of the uh, mycotoxin we select. Uh, LC uh, tandem mass spectrometry in addition offers us uh, the uh, possibility uh, to uh, cover a great range of different uh, mycotoxin. Certainly there are uh, there, there are a couple of challenges uh, uh, associated with, with this uh, approach of uh, um, including as many toxins as uh, uh, there are potentially there in the food chain. Uh, this uh, challenge is, starts with the extraction process where you are uh, uh, interested in uh, extracting all the analytes which are there. Uh, there is it's also a challenge uh, uh, in LC MMS MS uh, to uh, cover all these different concentration ranges of interest, whereas aflatoxins are extremely toxic molecules. Actually, uh, the most uh, um, carcinogen uh, substance on Earth, uh, which is known, uh, and on the other hand, uh, deoxynivalenol, which uh, occurs in the more moderate climatic regions of the world. Uh, is um, uh, is uh, regulated at a level of 1,500 microgram per kilogram, dependent on the commodity. So that is again a challenge uh, as, far, as far as on the one hand linearity, but also uh, sensitivity uh, is uh, is concerned. Uh, LCMS is still the most um, powerful uh, technique, uh, despite these challenges. Why? Because um, it's. Uh, does uh, not off only offer us uh, to detect these mycotoxins at, at very uh, high uh, sensitivity, uh, but uh, also without any cleanup. So we have developed at uh, Boku Ifatuln a method uh, which is based uh, on uh, the so-called dilute and shoot approach. So we do not apply any cleanup at all. So we extract, dilute the sample one plus one, and then. Uh, we perform the LCMS uh, uh, anal analysis. Uh, the only um, challenge, uh, though, still to be taken into consideration is to check for signal suppression uh, effects, uh, uh, which can sometimes be quite severe, dependent on, on, the, on, on the commodity. But now we have, for the first time, uh, a fully validated method available, which has been uh, published uh, uh, very recently in Journal, Journal of Chromatography A, uh, which uh, uh, has been fully in-house validated for 295 uh, different uh, secondary metabolites, uh, which are of high toxicological importance.